Here's how you can blur a video like this, 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 or even this in just a few simple steps. Start by logging into Clipchamp or sign up for free. Next, you'll be taken inside the editor. In this tutorial, I'll show you four different ways you can blur a video. The first is how to blur the entire video. The second is how to blur a specific part of your video. The third is how to add a blur effect over a subject. And lastly, how to create a blurred background. So to get started, you'll import the video you want to blur. Do this by clicking on the Import Media button, selecting the asset and hitting Open. It'll load into your media library here. Now add the video into your timeline by dragging and dropping it in, just like this. Now that it's loaded in, to blur the entire video, you'll click on the video in your timeline. It will highlight in purple so that you know it's selected. Then navigate over to the property panel on the right and click into the effects tab. You can either use the blur effect or the glass effect to blur the video. Simply click on the effect to apply it. You can then edit the intensity of the blur by dragging the slider left for less intensity or right for a more intense blur effect. Next, to blur a specific part of your video, you'll start by splitting your clip. Do this by dragging the seeker to the timestamp you want the blur to start. Then click on the scissors icon or hit S on your keyboard. Now move the seeker to the point you want that split to end and again hit the scissors icon. Your video will then be split into three clips. All you'll need to do now is click on that clip in the middle, jump over to the property panel and again click into effects. Select the blur effect, adjust the intensity of the effect and now that clip in the middle will be blurred. Next, let's say you want to blur someone's face, a number plate, or sensitive information. To add a blur effect over a subject, you're going to use the picture-in-picture -picture effect. This means you'll crop your video so that only the subject you want to blur is visible. For example, I only want to blur her face. So to do this, click on the video in your timeline and then navigate up into the stage. Now you'll click on the crop button and then crop the video into the section you want to blur. Again, for this example, it's only her face. When you're happy, hit done. Now jump back into the effects tab of the property panel and apply the blur effect to that cropped video. Then the last thing you'll need to do is drag and drop the original video into the timeline, placing it below your blurred video. Once that's all done, it will look something like this and you'll have a blurred subject. Lastly, to make your video background blurred while still focusing on the subject, click on the video in your timeline and head over to the effects tab in the property panel. But this time you're going to select the blur fill effect. You can now adjust the size and position of your video by dragging the corners of the asset in or out to make it bigger or smaller. Move it around anywhere on the video preview until you're happy with the placement. And it's as simple as that. Once that's done and all of your edits are complete, export your video by heading to the export button, selecting your video quality, and then once the export is complete, it will download straight to your device all ready for you to share. And that's how to blur a video online in four different ways. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for our weekly how-to videos.